past. Um, a lot has happened. Um, Riddle actually told me he loved, he loved me, but, um, I was really pissed because it took him seven fucking months to say he loved me and, like, all this time and, you know, now that he did whatever he had to do, it's like, oh, I love you again. You don't do that to somebody. That's unbelievable. So I, I kind of told him, you know, well, at first I, I lied about, like, my medical stuff. Um, I really didn't want to lie. But, um, truth is I've been feeling, um, like under the weather for the last couple of weeks. And, uh, it's really horrible, but, um, okay, I have essential tremors, irritable bowel syndrome, and, uh, oh yeah, and a learned disability, but, um, those three things, like, evade my life, you know? Because essential tremors, that makes you feel like you just... You can be like trying to stand still and you can feel your whole body go out. Plus it gives the appearance of anxiety. When you when you have a nervous problem, like a neurological problem, you your stomach goes kaput. So like every time Riddle would call me, um I'd have to go to the bathroom like in and out, in and out. And it was so hard to like cancel plan my plans. Even with him, because, you know, I, there was some part of me that really didn't want to see him, really wanted to, like, have a connection again, but, um, I just feel like, you know, why did he, you know, waste, you know, keep his distance from me so he can go out and party or whatever, and now that he's not near his, like, I guess family anymore. It's like, oh, I love you. I want to see you. You know, like, what? What the what? It's like really, it was depressing. And, um, he lied to me about a bunch of other things. He might see this and say, no, I've never lied to you. But the truth is, like, um, he said he would never look at you. You know, that he would always be there for me. Um, and then he loves me. First of all, you don't leave somebody that you love. Um, second of all, you don't do that to somebody that you love. And thirdly, um, if you listen to like your family members um, who say, oh, she's not good enough for you, why on earth are you like leaving the love of your life? Possibly, or whatever, or whatever comes out of your mouth for a family member that says she's not good enough for you. You know, so there's a lot of contributing factors, and I just felt like, you know, um, well, I'm not a, a liar for one, but, um, you know, like, I would tell my family, you know, a little bit here and a little bit there. Then, you know, oh, I, t I still talk to him or whatever. And they would just be like, don't go back. Because he's just going to leave you because a family member told, told him so or is whatever, you know. So talk to, like, my friends. Um, well, there's Heather... But I have two more, like, online, and they said the same thing. So, um, I go, I'm a member of these, um, social anxiety groups, and I asked a few of, like, my friends on those websites, like, what should I do? And they said to stay away because, you know, Riddle sounds like a sociopath. And then he just uses manipulation or something. So, you know, um, I really haven't been feeling well, I and mean, it's really hard to go to the store 
and you know your irritable bowel syndrome commit kicks in. I have to can cancel appointments and everything, but I guess it is better that Riddle stays away. I don't know, but I still love him very much, and I miss him like every day. And um, I'm going to therapy for that, believe it or not. But I guess this is something I have to deal with. I don't know. Oh, anyway, I wanted to show you like I've been making um magnets out of um catering caps. I like I really like to do a lot of uh, do-it-yourself um products. So here I did it. I, I drew, um, I painted Mickey Mouse on a cat. This is a cap from a Gatorade bottle. And I put like a Mod Podge with some magnets I got from Walmart. You have to stack three at a time and then put the Mod Podge in there until it dissolves. So here's Mickey, old time Mickey. Um, what else? Oh, I have this one. I did the Corpse Bride. This one I used uh, nail polish and um, white out for the eyes, Sharpie marker, and acrylic, acrylic paint for there. I don't know if you see it. I'm kind of shaking, so. Like I said, this is a Gatorade cap and uh, three magnets and inside the there. You can probably see it. And Mod Podge glue, which you can also get that at Walmart too. See, so I like that. Um, there's another one I did. This one I used um two coats of paint. I used a scrapbook sticker that I got from the dollar store. Um, I used the Mod Podge glue to stick it on tight and um. Yeah, the Gatorade cap and the magnets again with the Minecraft glue. Then there's that magnet. Um, and here's one um, I got a, a scrapbook stinger from um, Michael's. They have the big sales after Halloween. So look. And it even though it has skulls, I don't think anyone would know this. I don't know. But I thought it was really pretty. See, and then the cat Gatorade cap. And the magnets. So, I'm actually selling them on Lego.com. But, um, no one's, well, no one's bought them yet. So, I'm a, I actually want to make more. But, um, I have to get more white out. <sighs> but I just wanted to show you my magnets. I really like them. Oh, and also, um, my niece Angelina was born yesterday. This kid is so cute. Here. Uh, here. Like, she was born yesterday. And we can see her. See? This is my niece Angelina. She's so cute. Um, you want to see a flashback picture? Um,. That's me when I was a baby. And my brother's next to it. But I'm just gonna leave, leave this face out of it in case they ever find this. Okay. Um, here's me as a baby. You can see it. I'm kind of shaking a little bit. Oh, and here's Sam Sammy. My dog, um, when he was four months old. This is my favorite picture. Isn't he cute? That's right over there. Oh, and um, I was watching the Avengers 2 with my dog Simi. We do movie nights. It's kind of lame, but I don't care. Because he's, he's my furry kid. So. 
Wait, I love this picture. Apart from my ripped pajamas, I'm the one that's cute. This is my legs are crossed and they're cis. So, um, that's about it. I mean, told you about Riddle, and I wanted to confess my sins. Or, I don't know, um, what I did wrong, it's been eating me up for the last two days, and I tried to sell Riddle today. How I felt in a text message? You know, um, but I think I'm just more pissed off. More I'm pissed off between my medical problems. And the fact that Riddle isn't here, but even when he was here, he was never really here. So, um, I guess I just have to be, get really get used to being alone. Even, I'm taking up writing too. Um, I usually do writing on Penzu. Um, I did that years ago. I think it's for teenagers. I'm not really sure. But I found it on an accident years ago. Um, penzu.com. Um, so it's been really helping me a lot, writing like every chance I can get. Um, oh, and, um, yeah, that's still about it. I'm gonna think, uh, I wanna think, uh, drums class. It's supposed to help with your health and, Meditation or whatever. Um, I'm gonna sit and see if I can take um, guitar class because I have like a a lecture guitar. I won from for free like back in 2010 um, for like a breast cancer awareness. Um, you know, like a giveaway type of thing. It was a Michelle Branch electric guitar vendor. And it's like, um, no one's ever. She was like a one hit wonder, but a lot of people used to say when she was popular that I looked like her. So, I don't know. But now I have her guitar. So, well, not her guitar. It's signed by Michelle Branch. Um, I just need like one of those amps. Um, um, and I have like three ukuleles, so, um, uh, I really would like to play guitar, so I'm going to sign up for lessons, and I know this sounds lame, but I want to do that. I want to learn how to do the foxtrot, <laughs> because, um, I really love to dance, but I never had a really good dance partner, so. Actually, Brutal hated dancing. <laughs> I think the only thing he really know, knows to do if he does dance is the mosh pit. Because he likes death metal and a bunch of it. Anyway, here's Sam. Sammy. Oh, you're okay. He is at sleep apnea, so sometimes he stops breathing for like uh, under a minute and it freaks me out. My baby, you got so big and then the friend in the picture. You're only four months old in that picture. Oh. So, that's about it. Um, the, what I wanted to say is, I know a lot of people don't really like my vlogs, but, um, I hope there is, I hope it can help people, um, cope through a really bad time. And just know that, um, if you're going through a bad time, um, take it each day as it comes. That's what I, I did, and it's helping me. So, I love you. Long, big tits. <laughs> I'm bigger, but...